really neat program for if you have Windows XP. <laughs> Basically, it lets you have other themes than like the default ones that your computer comes with. So, the first time you launch it, it'll probably ask you to apply a theme to make sure it works. You can do that if you want. But if you open this up and you go to themes, and then you can just pick one of these. Um, I'll apply Panther. Click it, and then just apply theme. And give it a minute. Okay. Now, as you can see down at the bottom, it looks kind of like a Mac. You can unlock your toolbar and drag it to the top if you want, but I'm not gonna. And then to get your regular theme back, you can apply it in here. Just click Windows XP and then apply it. Okay, then it applies your theme back. And sometimes your background is a little bit like it didn't fill the screen. Just change that. Well, you can change it in the program too, but you can also right click on your desktop and then change it. But if you go to back, well, there's visual styles, which are pretty much the same thing. There's different backgrounds that they have that you can put on. Just gonna stretch that out. Okay, and there's also <coughs> logons. Changes what your logon screen will look like. change it to this one that says sorrow it's kind of like a gray one I think yeah in here and then there's another one Kronos it's pretty cool looking then you can change what your icons look like and there's boot screens. You can change transparency of like windows and stuff. And then there's some other stuff that windows comes with like different cursors and screensavers. Alright, this is Black and Soul. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.